Hello everybody, I am Tadashi Mori and in this video here I will teach you how to make the Origami Pelican by Joshua Golton. And before we start, uh, let me tell you, this origami here is really hard to make. Um, well, it's actually intermediate, but anyway, there are some really difficult folds and you have to use, you must use a, a really good paper that holds the shape and that's it, let's start. So to make this origami we're going to choose one square sheet of paper. Okay. This one here has 26 for 26 centimeters and with the color outside up you're going to fold like this. First of all fold the model in half like this along the diagonal and do the same thing here fold, fold in half again like this. I'm going to teach here at the beginning really fast, you just need to make the to-do base and well I'm teaching fast because this organ here is okay now open here this flat. This organ here is is a little bit difficult to make. So if you can't follow this beginning here at the start, you you basically won't be able to make the, the last part. It's going to be really hard. So I'm not going to teach slowly. Okay, so open here with this flap on this side and we made here the Tsuru base. Just like this. Now you're going to fold here with the open part, open side down. You're going to fold here this side of the paper up to the middle line. Like this, okay, and and then you're going to open here the model a little bit, and inside reverse fold along this line we just made, like this, and do the same thing to all four flaps. Okay, now the model will look like this, and hold here the model in this position here and now you're going to fold this point here up to the middle line but as there's no reference you have to fold about this much here uh, there's no reference in the diagram so I really don't know exactly where is the best place but I think this much here is okay yeah I, I guess this much here is okay. And do the same thing here. So fold exactly the same the same amount here. Okay. And both sides here are going to get aligned. Okay. So now you're going to squash here in the middle. So open here a little bit, just to squish and fold here this flap down like this. I don't know if I have to fold a little bit more, I guess. Well, maybe I have to fold a little bit more here. Well, okay, let me fold just a little bit more here. It's really hard to fold this kind of fold without reference because you have to, to keep folding several times until you 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 find the best place to fold so there's no reference in the diagram but it's something like this it's something like this the the bottom side here this side here is going to this flap here is going to hide this flap here, so about this much would be okay, right? Now you're going to fold here the side of the paper up to the middle line, okay, and unfold, do the same thing here. And unfold. Now you're going to fold along 
this line here. Okay. So you have this fold and this fold. You're going to fold along this line that connects both lines like this. And then you just open here the model. Now you're going to fold here this flap to the right and also this flap here and when you fold this flap you're going to pull here this point down okay. and let me see it's going to look like this okay and then then you just fold here Back to the left. Um, okay. Now you're going to do the same thing here. The other direction. Just open here, fold down, and fold back here, like this. Uh, let me see here. Now we're going to make a fold again without references and it's like this you have these two layers inside okay just fold your two two flaps to the to the right and you're going to open here these two layers inside just a little bit okay and then you have to fold along this line here and this line here at the same time so it's going to be like this this whole chair is not very easy to make it's going to look like this, right? Now you're going to make a mountain fold, fold along this middle line, okay? And make it get straight uh, and fold here this flap to the left and make this. This flap here gets straight to the left, like this. So do the same thing here. So you have to open here this middle layer, right? Like this. Also here. This kind of folds are just to to re make to reverse the color to, to show the colored part of the paper okay so now you have to reverse fold and make it get straight to the side the right side like this okay now turn the model over you're going to fold your this layer here, this side here up to the middle line and after you fold here you're going to open this pocket here okay and pull here to the right and squash the paper like this do the same thing here That's it. 
Okay, now you have to fold here the whole model in half, like, uh, like, uh, like this, okay? Right. It's a little bit too bright, let me just adjust here. Okay, now you're going to fold here along this line here. Okay, you're going to reverse fold along this line here, so it's like this, it's an outside reverse fold. Okay, and do another outside reverse fold. going to look like this okay now just pull here one layer from inside of the top part just to make the color side show up like this and the same thing here okay now we are going to make the most difficult part of this this origami here and it's like this you have this part here right you're going to open here all the layers and be really careful here because you don't want to, to rip the paper okay and open here all the layers like this right And it's really hard to open here these last layers because the paper here is trapped. So it's just like this. I don't know exactly how to explain this part. You just have to keep unfolding here, opening these layers. Okay. And I guess that's it. Well, I think that's it. But let me see here. Now we are going to. Now I have to do the following. You have this line here and this line here, these two middle lines, right? You're going to fold down like the, the, the middle the middle fold here, the middle line here, you're going to make a valley fold like this. Okay, that's it. Now you just have to close here the model. Really, this part here is really hard because it's not step by step, it's just open here and then close here the whole model. So I found it really hard to make to follow the, the diagram in this part here but I guess maybe you can do it a lot faster than me you have to keep adjusting your the paper while you close here the model
that's it. Okay, I, I know it's really hard to follow this part here. My, but now let's just fold like this now. Um, you're going to fold here this part like this just a little bit about this much here and fold the sides to make it get a little more get a round shape okay and then you close here okay the model will look like this Now we are going to fold here the, the tail and the tail is going to be like this. You have to make a crimp fold. It's just like this. You just have to press here the middle and then you fold everything down. Okay, and that's it. Now let's make the wings. Okay, the wings are going to be like this. You have to make another cream food. Well, I guess I basically prefer just to open here the wings a little bit, but the diagram is a little bit different. I think this way is easier. Just open here a little bit the wings. That's it. Okay. Okay. Now let's just shape here the the face a little bit to make it. This part here is just like this. You don't have exact folds. You just have to keep folding and shaping the model. So if you use paper that holds the shape a little bit better than this one, it's going to be a lot easier to make. This one is just really hard because the paper do not hold shape. But that's it. Now the legs. The legs you're just going to... Let me see here. You're going to fold here a small part to the front. Like this, you, you push here the middle and reverse it, just like this, okay? So let me show you again. You just press here the middle and fold to the front, like this. And you're going to open here the middle a little bit. Fold a small part down and make two small curves here so you can have the small fingers so you have to be really careful with this fold here That's something like this. I couldn't make it uh, really well. But okay. You just need to fold really carefully. And it's like this. And do the same thing here to this side. Okay. So open here a little bit. Here to the front, this and spread the fingers. Okay, 
I'll fold the small amount and make the fingers. I, I won't make here because it's going to be a little bit hard to make now. And I guess that's it. That's, you just have to adjust here now the, the shape of the model. Mm, like making it get a little bit more fat here. <laughs> just shape it okay the model is basically this but you have to shape the model the way you want to shape just look a picture and of a pelican and I keep trying to shape it okay it's not really easy to show all the details because there's no reference to any folder I'm making now so basically that's it so I hope you liked it thanks for watching this video see you bye bye